Hey y'all, I just wanted to FYI y'all. This stuff is really good y'all. This L'Oreal Face Cleanser. It feels really good and it smells really good. And the um, cream, the moisturizing cream. It's kind of expensive, but it actually is really good. So I'll let you know if I can see any results based on, you know, my skin. You know, it's collagen and elasticity as they say. And y'all, um, where is, oh, here it is. Um, y'all, this is the business. Remember I told y'all I was itching because of the mosquito bites. I'm here to tell y'all, I put this on my legs one time. I have not itched since. This is the business. I'm sure there might be an Equate brand or any store that has their own brand. But I don't care. I'm just going to pay the extra one or two dollars more. This will stay in my medicine cabinet. The business. Get it. And stay tuned for an upcoming video. I got a new new. This is my outro. Fab and Fly. Isn't she cute? That's coming up on the next video, y'all. Let's go grocery shopping. y'all right, we're done we're done we're done we're done hundred and fifty dollars later we're done <laughs> good morning good morning everybody y'all I am hungry this one I can't woke up with a big appetite um just been laying low watching TV and reading we're just doing a big omelet with some bacon this morning um, I've already got some garlic, onions, diced onions, um, some tomatoes, mushrooms, and I'm getting ready to put some baby spinach. I take the stems off my baby spinach, and then I'm going to put three eggs in here. And this is breakfast, y'all. So I'm doing what I got to do. Okay, here are my scrambled eggs over here. I'm going to put some of this cheese in it. And this is uh, baby spinach. I love this organic baby spinach. And just sliced mushroom and grape tomatoes. Okay, y'all, I'm going to just cook this down. But look, y'all, while I'm doing this, I wanted to talk to you real quick. I'm just going to be laying it low. Um, um, I know it's all over the news with Tamar Braxton. I'm going to put a little seasoned salt in here. A little bit and I picked this up from the grocery store yesterday I was gonna do a haul but y'all I got in here it was hot and I just put all my groceries up but I, I I grocery shop for about two weeks worth of food so that's why I came up to 150 and I was just out of a lot of stuff this is pretty good y'all it's got a little kick to it and uh, Louisiana Cajun seasoning okay but anyway, with everything going on in the news, and I thought about um, Miss Tamar Braxton and everything that's in the media, and I, I'm not going to try to put a narrative on it other than, you know, for us to just pray for our sister. I'm just praying for whatever went on, whatever went down, allegedly her... Her boyfriend, her current boyfriend, found her unresponsive. Um, the police that also responded did confirm that they did get a call that a 43-year-old woman had been... Um, there was a call for medical attention. What that medical attention is, we don't know. But again, the only thing that I am going to be speaking on is just... 
that we pray for one, pray for her, pray for one another, um, and just pray for her family. You know, like I said, I am a fan. I love Tony Braxton when they first came out with Braxton Family Values. Um, I was front and center. Now it's been a while since I've watched their show because you know, life, life, and I just had got away from watching it, but. Um, I do follow her, um, and her sister and all that and their show. And she's like, I think she's got a, now when I say, I think it's a new show because like I said, I'm, since we've been in quarantine, I mean, you know, I've been watching different stuff, but it's called to catch a beautician. And, um, seemed like I saw, I actually saw the show on YouTube, maybe. But I think she's actually on on TV. But anyway, so, and I know her and her boyfriend do like a couples quarantine um, type of um, YouTube uh, thing on her YouTube channel. But anyway, like I said, I know I'm just talking. I want some more cheese, y'all. I, I have got a big appetite this morning. But anyway, whatever the case may be, uh, I'm just praying for with Miss Tamar. I know she knows the Lord and all that good stuff and I just ask that the Lord bless her and keep her and heal her whatever whatever the medical attention she needs. Uh we believe God that he is the chief physician. Amen. Oh, this smells so good and it's going to taste real good. Y'all, I wanted to show y'all something too. My boss, she she put a picture on her Instagram. I thought, are you kidding me? It's a uh, Old Bay hot sauce. So you know I'm going to try that on these eggs. You know I'm going to try it on these eggs. But uh, anyway, y'all, again, we can ooh and ah about what's going on with people. But ultimately, um, I, I just want to just lift her up in prayer. I know this looks like mush, but I don't want to cook it too fast because I don't want my, I want my spinach to still have their nutrients in it. But anyway, that's all I wanted to come on and say. Of course, Sunday dinner will be here. I'm trying to debate. I think I'm gonna um, cook me a steak. I, well, I know I'm gonna cook me a steak because I put this, and then I bought some zucchini and squash. So I'll probably do that with onions, and that's it. Um, and I I might do rice, but I think that's what I've got a taste for. A nice good old steak and some John Brown zucchini and squash mixed, stir fried in the pan. And that's going to be what's for dinner. And I'll see y'all over there on the flavor train. And again, keep everybody in prayer. Everything, Everybody that's going through whatever, we're all still in the thick of things. We're all still going through stuff, y'all. We just need to keep everything lifted in prayer we really do and you know words matter um, some words you can you know let them roll off your back but then there's some words that if you put life to words um, it, they can be damaging to a person to a person's brand so just be mindful of the words that we speak to and about one another. Amen. Amen. Again, Tamar, love you. Y'all, she's down here on these YouTube streets. You never know who's watching your show. I never knew Elgin Charles was watching my show. You know, and he, wa and he was. He's tuned in to a couple of my live chats when I do Bible study live. So, again, Tamar, if you're watching my show, Shug, I love you. God bless you. God keep you. You know he is the great I am. There ain't nothing that God won't do and provide you a way of escape out of. Ain't nothing too hard for God. Amen. And I just pray that he continue to touch and heal you and care for you as you cast your cares upon him. Standing in the gap, sister. Standing in the gap. But anyway, y'all, I love y'all so much.
Y'all have an awesome Sunday. God bless. And may the peace of the Lord be with you. And y'all, I'm about to sit down and eat this scrambled egg concoction. I was going to make an omelet, but it's, this is going to do what it's going to do. <laughs> All right, y'all. Bye. And yes, I got my nails done. Yes. Just something fun and different. We in the house, y'all. We in the house. We can get away with a little bit of stuff. Because <laughs> at work, I be in front of people talking and training and stuff. And they, I don't want my nails to be a distraction. But, you know, who cares? We're having fun now. Summertime. Anyway, love y'all. God bless. And again, may the peace of the Lord be with you. And we love you, Tamar. God bless. <laughs>